please buckle up for takeoff as we prepare to embark upon our low altitude flight along the project alignment. We'll be flying at about 200 feet, so don't be alarmed if we experience some moderate turbulence. Our roughly four mile journey begins in the city of Shoreline, followed by the city of Mount Lake Terrace, and ends in the city of Linwood. Here you are looking at the Mount Lake Terrace Transit Center that will have the first of two light rail stations on this project. We are now coming up on the G-Bridge. This is one of the more challenging bridges to construct on this project. It spans the I-5 freeway, which is one of the busiest highways along the West Coast. As we continue going north, we are now in the city of Mount Lake Terrace. Our primary staging area is located here. Across the street is our project office, which houses over 100 of my colleagues. If you look closely, you can see a few of us hard at work through the windows. In the northern half of our project, we have several large retaining wall structures. For most people, these structures may not be as captivating as our bridge structures, but I assure you, for those of us who love to play in the mud, these structures are just as glamorous and equally critical to the success of the project. We are currently looking at the Scriber Creek Trestle.
The trestle was constructed over the short summer due to the sensitive nature of the wetland below. This elevated guideway is the second station located at the Linwood City Center Transit Hub. To the right, we can see the home of the future 1600 stall parking garage. But as of right now, it's Robin's hole in the ground. When our work here is done, residents will be able to park in the garage, hop on the light rail for a quick 30 minute trip to downtown Seattle. Just as quick, our flight is almost over. So please stow away your belongings as items may have shifted during flight. Please refasten your seatbelts as we prepare for landing.